This is the music of African Portuguese composer Vicente Lusitano. I'll tell you about him coming up. This is KRT, Critical Race Theory. It's not the one they teach in law school, but the one banned in public schools. Vicente Lusitano was a remarkable composer of African descent. He was born in Portugal around 1520 and active in Europe during the Renaissance period. He became a Catholic priest, composer, and music theorist. In 1551, Lusitano left Portugal for Rome in pursuit of his musical career. And in 1551, he published a collection of motets. These were sacred polyphonic choral compositions. In the same year, he got embroiled in a public debate around the rules of composition and the use of different tuning systems. He won the debate, but felt the consequences of his victory when his rival composer conducted a smear campaign against him. After 1553, Lusitano became a Protestant and moved to Germany, where he received payment for some of the music he composed in 1562. Despite his achievements in Rome, Lusitano's music wasn't widely copied and wasn't spread across Europe. This led to a lack of recognition for centuries. What happened to Lusitano's memory has happened to countless other black people in Europe's history. The discrimination they faced didn't end with their deaths. 19th century Europe's music histories had no room for black people. And even today, uncovering classical music's black history can lead to hostile reactions. However, due to a recent revival of interest, his music and story are now being heard once more with the new records and concerts being staged. Say his name. Vicente Lusitano. This has been KRT talking about the African Portuguese composer Vicente Lusitano. Thanks for checking in. Thanks for being there. Like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. <laughs>